Hey guys, what's up? I'm Brian here doing another video for you guys and this time it's probably going to get a couple of dislikes because it's Combiner Wars, but one, I don't care about dislikes, and two, well, it's Combiner Wars. I, I, I personally like the line of Combiner Wars, so if you don't, that's fine. But if you don't, I don't know why you clicked on this video. Anyways, so let's go ahead and go through the Combined Wars figures. Someone asked uh, a couple of months ago if I can do an updated video on my Combined Wars collection, and it's grown since then, so I decided, you know, why not? Now, before I show off anything, I've got pretty much my combiners all set. They're not separated because in my shelf, it, it just, like, when I separate the figures, it just takes up a lot of room. So I decided, you know what, I'm just going to combine them and leave them like that, for the time being at least, especially when I'm trying to get like Titans Returns figures and I don't have a lot of room on my shelf anymore. So let's go ahead and just go through them, I will go through them by wave, and then we will also look at all the other Combiner Wars stuff, like the Leader Class figures, the Legends and whatnot. Oh yeah, and also I didn't combine the Legends onto these guys, you don't need them. And honestly, some of them aren't really that good with the combiners, like Blackjack and Power Glide. Just adds a lot of weight to the figure. Anyways, I'm pretty sure you've waited long enough. Let's go ahead and go through them. All right, for the first combiner, we have Alpha Bravo, uh, Firefly, uh, was it Skydive, and Air Raid, as well as Silverbolt to make a Superion. Yes, I don't have the. Was it the uh, Quick Slinger figure? But it doesn't matter. I still like Alpha Bravo, so that's okay. Um, and I think this is pretty cool. It's one of my favorite combiners. Um, might actually be my favorite. I'm not sure, but there's that. And then moving on from that, we have my least favorite combiner in my collection. We have Menasaur with the Breakdown, Off Road, Drag Strip. Dead End and Motormaster. Yes, I, I'm more recognizable to these characters than the aerial bots. Um, you know, I don't hate this setup, but I totally understand where people are coming from when they hate this setup because it's just not that good. A lot of loose joints and whatnot. But there we go, I do not have the, um, the Breakneck figure, aka Wild Rider, so there is that. Moving on to the next wave of Combining Wars figures, we have Rook, Streetwise, Blades, uh, First Aid, which is my favorite deluxe class figure, and then Hotspot to form Defensor. That is pretty cool. I like this setup. This is one of my favorites, too. I don't know, just something about it. I love the Protectobots. Always love Defensor. I think Defensor was always my favorite Autobot combiner, so there is that. And then moving on to the next wave, we have Prowl, Ironhide, Sunstreaker, Mirage, and Belcor Optimus Prime to make, I believe this is Optimus Maximus, I don't know, there's like two different versions of Optimus Prime in Combiner Wars. One of, one of them is Optimus Maximus and then the other one has a different name, so whatever. Anyways, I actually like this uh, Combiner Wars setup, I know it's pretty much uh, Menasaur redone, but it's done better than Menasaur, in my personal opinion. So, moving that to the side again. And the last combiner I have... I do not have any of the box set stuff. I do not have the Skyrim set. But what I do have is Bruticus. This is one of two of my very first Bruticuses, because I got two on the same day. So that is pretty cool. Um, and Bruticus was always my favorite Decepticon combiner. So, there is that. Anyways, those are pretty cool, but we also have a lot of other stuff to take a look at, so let's go ahead and go through that. The first thing we will take a look at is, uh, let's go through the Legends. So, we got a Legends Power Glide figure. Let's get some light onto that. There we go. I don't have a lot of lights going on for right now, but there is a Power Glide. I really do like this figure, definitely wanted it. And then we also have a... I believe this is Bombshell, I don't know, they constantly change the names of the Insecticons. Definitely wanted this because they are doing a kickback and I already had the Scrapnel figure, so there we go. And then we also have the repaints in the same way. We have a, uh, not Wild Rider, this is a Wind Charger, which I was fine with. I actually like this guy more and more as I look at it. Not perfect, but whatever. 
And then we have a Thundercracker. This is always my favorite seeker other than Acid Storm. And even then, I think Thundercracker takes the cake. So we got that. And then we also have a Blackjack figure, which I can't remember where I put the weapon, unfortunately, but there's that. Very cool. I like this guy. Um, can't remember who sent it to me. Um, I know that kind of sucks, but um, I can't. I, I, I'm thinking of two people. It's either James Boozer or uh, Chris Vellner. I think it's Chris Vellner. Um, and then we also have Skywarp, which is pretty cool. I like this. Um, never got the Starscream though, so I don't have a complete Seeker team. And then we also have a Rodimus. This is my first Hot Rod slash Rodimus figure, so that is pretty cool. Definitely get the uh, Deluxe when that comes out in my area. And then we also have, for Voyagers, we have an Optimus Prime, so that's pretty cool. This is the normal colors of Optimus Prime. I do like the white one version probably more than this, but uh, still cool nonetheless. I'm just going to put that to the side. And then we also have a Cyclonus. I don't know, just thought it was cool. Um, actually got this as a gift, so there's that. Um, also, the Air Raid. I forgot to mention, the Air Raid was sent by Larry Arts Productions, so I gotta give him a shout out for that. But yeah, Cyclonus, very nice. Love that figure. And then, uh, let's move on to the leader class figures. We have an Ultra Magnus. And that was given to me by Aegis, uh, or not Aegis 3 and up, um, Lazy Eyebrow Reviewer. Ironically enough, I was tapping my eyebrow trying to remember his name. So, yeah, I paid like 50 bucks for this, so that is pretty cool. It's pretty much complete. Actually, it is complete. So there's that. So, moving that off to the side right here, just so that it gets out of the way. We also have a Megatron sent in by Brave Toys Reviews because I won his contest, and that's pretty cool. Um, say what you want about Megatron, I actually don't mind this. I, I kind of like the fact that he's a leader class figure, so there is that. I kind of want to get the, uh, the Optimus Prime, the leader one, so that I can have a nice comparison between the two. And then the last one, but not least, from Ages 3 and Up, is Combiner Wars Groove. I paid 30 bucks for this, which is the reason why it's not combined with Defensor is because one, then uh, Rook kind of feels lonely, and two, this is really an exclusive figure, so I thought, you know what, I just want to show this off by itself because it looks good by itself too. I mean, it looks good combined, but uh, I mean, look at this, look at this, this is very nice. So that is pretty much it. That is my Combiner Wars collection. Let's see if I can zoom out enough so that you can see it. I'm sorry that the lamps are in the way. I'm sorry for the lighting. But we have five full combiners. We have a total of, I believe it's seven Legends class figures, an extra Deluxe class, and two Leader class figures, an extra couple of Voyagers, um, in total for deluxes, there's about, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, and then for Voyagers, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, so that's pretty cool, just a ton of figures, and people complain about the repaints, but look at the amount of figures, and most of these have like four alt modes, it's like, God, or, or three alt modes other than the robot mode, or something, I don't know. But anyways, that is pretty much it. I thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, and all those fun do-dats. And I will see you guys next time. Fist the bomb.